Hi ladies, welcome. My name is Evelyn Wood and today I have another head scarf tutorial for you. This time I'm doing a very classic style 1940s Rosie the Riveter kind of vibe. Very quick and easy to use every day. So let's get started. So today let's start with uh, this is my top trick on keeping your hair underneath all in place is to use a hairnet underneath. So if you have particularly long hair, I mean you want to tie it up in maybe a ponytail and you can use an actual wig cap like this one here. It's quite strong. I used to use this when I had longer hair, uh, but I don't have that problem anymore. So I also use just the little perm nets that you find in the salon. Uh, so get some of those. Today I will show you how to use this. I just pop it on like so. It doesn't really have to keep much in place but it will keep your hair from slipping out the bottom. There's nothing worse than that in a turban I think. All right, once you've got your hair up and secured, next you want to actually use your scarf. So today I've got a scarf here about yay big. I found this one in a thrift store, so you can use them all of the time. You find them all of the time. Uh, so now start, fold it over. I usually about that much or so, depends on how big your scarf is, but that's what I'll do today. Now I'm going to put it on, I've just flipped it round. So I've got that on the base of my neck there, and I'm going to pull this up. Make sure this is tucked in down here. Now make yourself a little knot there we go now what do you do with this you can do a few things you can simply just tuck that in you should have a little pocket that you can tuck that into there and pull nice and tight make sure that your ears are out so you can hear properly. Now, just tie that into a little bow. Now before you pull it too tight, you just need to arrange all your little bow bits here. So I like to put the tails at the back so they sit away from my head. And pull out little loop parts so that they're quite ginormous really and I also like to make it a little bit uneven on my head um there you go now uh, if you're going to work I always like to maybe put a few bobby pins here and here uh, just for a day if you're going to be doing a lot want some extra security otherwise because you have that hairnet underneath or well, your hair will stay there in place quite well and you're done so there's so many different ways to tie turbans and uh, I'm doing a little series on my YouTube channel so stay tuned and I'll uh, keep you up to date with all the uh, other little tips and tricks I have for vintage styling uh, so stay tuned I hope you enjoyed thanks for watching see you next time